How is it possible there's even a one South African person that don't have food tonight, that don't have shelter? What happened to the land's resources then? Who's managing it then? If you look back and you compare it with what is happening now, it was not worth it. You can't avoid what we have done to fellow human beings in this country. Apartheid, it was that you can't marry who you fall in love with. You can't go on the beach there, you have to go to the beach there and you can't sit on the same bus. You could go to jail if, if you had a girlfriend that was black or colored or whatever, you know. Even walking in the pavements of town, you know what will happen. The man will even punch you if he wants to. I was seeing images on television of the police and the military going into townships and shooting at young people, throwing stones at them. It was me who did that. I'm a lefty, you see. I don't miss. Up to 35 people at the end of the day were shot and killed. How do you blame the people of the past for the mist that surrounded them? They were acting there in their place. Yes, there are exceptions. We don't want to repeat the stuff in history. We want to learn from history, of course, yeah. I put her ex next to Nelson Mandela. You're like, God, what does it feel like inside? We're going to be all equal now. OK. What does that mean? That is very naive. It's much more complex than that. We are here, we're in Urania. If there were not 53 million black people in South Africa, would Urania exist? Probably no. Probably no. We feel not slag of any vijandskap in our other people. We are not just lief for our eyes. I think it's important that every culture on its own can function. This kind of hyper-policing of political correctness you know, has become a new kind of fascism, you know? This is not the freedom we fought for. But the politics have changed. We have a democracy, we have a black government, but the daily lives of people are still shaped by the past. We thought everything was going to be okay, but nothing was okay. Nothing, we were still fighting. The whole concept of freedom, gone. The reconciliation between white and black people is absolutely crucial. I mean, everybody hopes for, I think.